road. Today we're headed out to hike in Fall Creek Falls State Park. This is the Andy Field picnic area. No, there's locks on it. Can you see? Fireplace. And Here's the Fall Creek Falls Lake. All kinds of deer out there on the side of the trail or the road. All right. Jerry and I are here at Fall Creek Falls uh, Fall parking Creek area. Falls. Um, <laughs> we're, we're right here where the overlook is, which I'm assuming is um, just kind of, I don't think it's very long to get down to the falls. We really don't even need a pack on, but we're kind of going to try to, you know, walk around. There's another falls called Piney, Piney something falls, Piney Falls. So we just went and put our packs on, um, just so we have like our water and snack if we want it. Our uh, my coat, just in case I do get colder. There's not much in it. You could probably hike this whole area without anything. <laughs> There's the parking area, and and here is the overlook sign. So it looks like it kind of looks like we're just gonna walk up and then be there to me but um a little some signage here's the see here's the map i guess the nice thing about coming right now is there's hardly anyone out there's a few people right now but there's hardly anyone out here um just winter there's not very many people you got a water fountain yeah, you've, <laughs> you've got restrooms uh picnic table restroom. so yeah this is see this is just right here we're gonna try to see if we can just kind of hike to other parts then so that's why I was like, let's just put our pack on because maybe we can hike, hike, <laughs> walk. Cause if it's all paved, it's gonna it's gonna be more like a walk. <laughs> and here's like a little sign about it. If you want to read it, you can pause the video, read that. So. Let's see here. Oh yeah, wow, look at that. So pretty. So you've got a sign here that says you can get to base of Fall Creek Falls Trail four tenths of a mile. That's one way. All right, we're gonna head down to the base of the falls here. Jerry's trying to selfie. Look at the balls from here. Triangle. We've got a little bit of an actual trail for a second here, it looks like. <laughs> got some rock steps. And just kind of keeps going down, down that direction. And that's really cool looking. It's like a little alcove. Jerry's all squished in the rock. <laughs> Fat guy in a little backpack. So yeah, this brought us down just the other side of the rock, back on the trail. You see the icicles hanging from the... Mm -hmm. 
to the falls from here. Oh, and <laughs> icicles are falling from the sky. Yeah, now we're scrambling up some more rocks. Rock scramble. This is really cool. Look over here. See the water falling? Wow, look, it looks like we're about to enter a winter a winter wonderland over here. And I left my crampons in the car because I didn't think I needed them. Hopefully it's just now enough you can look at the ice on that look at this it's like all snowy right through here now look at this look at the icicles wow look at that look at this this is so cool wow this is so cool Ooh, it is ice, ice, ice through here. Oh, um, look at this. That is just magnificent looking. All right, one last shot of this falls before we, look at that, just the, all the ice around here so cool it's very icy on the ground it's hard to tell but I mean look at all these icicles they just keep falling there's some more right here be very careful look the camera shows like these purples I guess from the Sun hitting the ice Oh, it's so cool right here. My mom's playing tricks on me. This was totally worth the... Oh, excuse us. No, you're good. This place is gorgeous. It is. It's so cool over there with all the ice. It took us a little over two hours to get here um, from Knoxville. But man, that, it was worth it. I mean, already. Just so cool that uh, the waterfall like that with all the icicles. Man, I sort of typically favor the national parks, but we have so many state parks around us, and this is really cool. So we're gonna have to make it a maybe make it a goal to start trying to hit some more some more of the state parks around me. All right, we are back where we started. Man, it's a lot warmer up at the top. <laughs> I had to even take my jacket um, off, my mid layer off because it's pretty warm up here. Now, when we started the trail, it was 31 degrees. I don't know what the temperature is. I think the high was supposed to be 40 today, um, but it could be 40. I mean, it's so sunny right now, but man, and it was so cold down at the bottom. Um, so, Jerry's taking a break. <laughs> We stop for a minute to kind of unclothe and uh, have a little, little bit to drink. I got uh, a new drink with me today. It's the Sobe Strawberry Dragon Fruit. Mm. So there's a trail here. It says Nature Center. So I don't know if it takes you above the falls or not. It looks like it could though. It looks like it might wrap around. Oh, here's a sign. Campground Cascades trail to Cane Creek Falls. Huh. Okay. Right now this trail looks a little bit more like a trail. I mean as far as um, not being paved. Just when we first drove in it seemed like there was a lot of paved trails. Hopefully it stays like this. This intersection right here you have um, that direction's lower loop trail, which on that map looked like it was like a 12 mile loop. And then it looks like you have a trail going this way and it almost looks like a trail over here. Let's 
Metro. Looks like it might take you down to the top of the falls. I'm hoping. Let's see if that's where it goes. Oh, it's, yeah, it's just another like, yeah, like a little overlook over the. Oh, okay. So another it's a overlook. Another angle of the falls. And then I think if you go that way, you go back up to the other trail. It looks like there's a trail that goes this way. Let's see where this takes us. Excuse me. Oh wow, well, look, there's a rainbow. Can you see it? Oh, how cool. A rainbow. You can go a little farther down past that little area. And then you have another area. Wow, look at this. Look, there, there's people down there. You see them right there. Oh, look at that, it's so pretty. It kind of makes me think of being in a tropical rainforest somewhere in another country. Look at the rainbows back. Luckily, I'm not too afraid of heights. Afraid of falling, but. <laughs> yeah, get down your book. <laughs> Just because, like, right there, drops off. That's where we were earlier. Yeah, we're like right, we're actually at the top of this fall, fall right here, the smaller one. And there it is, there's the part that goes down. There it goes. Beautiful. That is gorgeous. Look at this lovely little bridge you can cross. Hasha, do not go behind fence. Keep out restoration area. It's gotten colder again. I almost need to put my gloves back on. So I think this is gonna bring us down to where the river that flows into that large falls you just saw. The Falls Creek Falls. Got another bridge. We got some very nice bridges here. Yeah, that water is flowing good. No wonder it makes such a huge falls. get my gloves out. I'm freezing. Hands are cold. Some people. Yeah, I think uh, you could bring your dogs on most state park trails. I think you can bring dogs. So that's always an alternative if you're someone wants to take your dog out for a hike. Hit the state parks. Hi. Hello. Hi. Oh, is this pretty dog? Get out of pit. Yeah, you're sure. funny. Hi there, sweetie. Oh. How are you doing? <laughs> Hello there. <laughs> Hello. So that's the gorge overlook. So you go, I guess, either way. Gorge the overlook or the woodland trail. That's the nature center. Yeah, well, I think they see it says two nature center. I guess you go either way. Let's go to the gorge or overlook. This 
is one of the man-made man -made things that I like to see on trails is things like this. I just, yeah, I don't mind it at all when I see the planks and just that kind of thing. It adds a little bit to a trail in a way that isn't obtrusive, you know, or an eyesore, but makes uh, hiking the trail easier sometimes. So I don't know if any of you follow me on Instagram, but if you don't and you want to, you can check me out at Hiking with Braids. But anyway, that wasn't the point. The point was, so on Instagram, the other day I put something up about not really feeling like I have any goals right now. And truthfully, I have goals. I have like long-term goals, things I want to accomplish, things I, I really want to do. But kind of in the immediate, kind of for the year. Um, I have a couple of things I'd like to do. We definitely want to do another trip out west, at least one this year if possible. Um, but um, I don't know, just haven't really had anything particular. Um, do what? Yeah, yeah, let's do that. Um, so we're going to the Rocky Point Overlook. Let me show you real quick. Rocky Point Overlook. Anyway, so my point being is, I think I'm going to make a goal this year to try to hit some more of the state parks um, in the surrounding national parks as opposed to trying to hike at quite as much in the Smokies. I'll still do some Smokies. It's just so close. It's just an easy, like, day, you know, go out and do a day hike or something. Um, and my hope at the end that I would be able to video, you know, all of the trails for you. So that if you come to my channel, then if you're, you know, if you're like, oh, I wish I knew what this trail looked like, you could watch one of my videos and find out about the trails of the Smokies. But uh, coming out here like this, this is just really cool. This is kind of a nice change. I like seeing new things probably more than I do anything else. There's a rocky outlook, so we're hiking over to it before we hit the nature center. Alright, so we have this little... Look, that's what you were talking about earlier. Right? Oh yeah, that's see, those people are over there. Yeah, so see, now we can go down here. It's pretty rocky. Um, okay. Let me turn the camera off, it's too hard. I'm going down that way. All right, now we gotta go down these rocks. We're gonna go down that kind of direction over to there. Oh my gosh, there's a cave, Jerry. Yeah, you can't go that way. See, they've got it chained off on both sides. But they don't have this chained off. So, let's go see what we got to work with. You're totally doing rock climbing if you go this direction. Oh yes, that's what I'm talking about, people. Oh, yeah, see that's where we were at earlier. Right there. I'm on top of the world! Woo! Uh. Jerry, it's pretty cool. Pretty cool. <laughs> Take a picture of me. No, there's no rules broken. There's chains on both sides. There was no chain right here. Hey, will you take a picture of me? But this is pretty cool. See like this whole little like outcropped area. Kind of it's a little past the waterfalls. That was fun. This has been a pretty cool hiking trail. If you ask me. All right, we are back at the trail. That was nice to do a little bit of rock climbing. I enjoy rock climbing. Uh, that was pretty cool. And now this part of the trail is quite nice. Very nice, actually. I'm very pleased with this 
um, with the chosen destination today. Um, like I said, you just don't know sometimes what you're going to expect. And pictures can sometimes make things look really cool, but then, you know, but just to, this is a really nice area. I like it. Um, we want to come back when it's a little warmer. Maybe do some camping, some backpacking, I should say. This is a very scenic part of the trail. I like this. Very nice. Why don't you look and see what temperature it is? Yeah, that is one thing if you hike Fall Creek Falls trails, um, you will still have internet access. Oh, is it 42? Huh. 40? Okay, so it's 40 degrees right now. This is how I like to hike right here. This is, this is nice. <laughs> Pine needle trail with hardly any roots, no rocks. Oh, look, Cane Creek, Cane Creek Golf Overlook. Let's check it out. Let's, let's take a quick gander. This is the danger. Trail ends here. It's funny, it says trail ends here and then you can tell where people have actually went down there. Um, hmm, yeah, I'm not really sure how that's an overlook. All right, well, that was disappointing. Let's see what else we got going here on this trail. We're coming to another sign. What's this sign say? Oh, <laughs> let's see, it's a real, it really is the overlook. Let's find out if this is a dud like the other one was. Hopefully not. Yes. They're on the steps. a really lovely hike. Another sign. Nature Center. Oh look, there's a corn. funny thing is it's a car but there doesn't seem to be a trail so yeah somebody built a unnecessary corn our first switchback <laughs> uh, another corn apparently some of people who are hiking this trail don't understand what it means to build a corn <laughs> what is used for oh, no, <laughs> Oh, because it's like a... It's like Jenga, but better. Yeah, it is. Kind of, yeah, you're right. That's impressive. <laughs> well, okay. That is true. That. I mean, that's... We are almost back at the... I say almost back. We are almost at the Nature Center, I think. Um, it looks like I can see a building from here. I thought there's one other falls that I wanted to see that I haven't seen. So, I can't remember the name of it. It started with a P. <laughs> now, now we have some stairs to... Easy stairs. Oh my gosh, yes! <laughs> well, this has been an awesome hike. Holy crap. We got a swinging bridge, people. Holy Lord. Look at that, people. That is so cool. And then here you got the, it goes right over the falls. 
That's awesome. Crossing the swinging bridge. God, it just feels like it's shaking so. <laughs> oh my God. Uh, oh wow. <laughs> Woo! Oh my gosh, that is. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> God, it just feels like it's bouncing all over the place. <laughs> Woo! Oh yeah. <laughs> it feels like it's like totally bouncing. So right off the bridge, there's like a another little trail. And it takes you down to the bottom under the bridge. Get a little closer look at these falls. Danger. Big Fort Mill site. Wow, look at that. That's cool. another like little outcropping right here some stairs that takes you down to another landing this is no diving or jumping really that should be on this oh look at this get to get up close and personal place to stop and like eat lunch or something I mean man I know why this place is one of the most visited state parks man this is just amazing yeah look at this you can come like practically walk right up the looks like uh <laughs> looks like they're renovating this or building it or something it looks kind of new i don't even know what this is i assume it was a <laughs> nature center but <sighs> then we'll find out when we get to the top I don't know if that just means that they were redoing the facade. I don't know. I don't even know what that is. Assumed it was the nature center. Maybe restrooms over there. Some more parking here. I don't know how far away we are. Oh, okay. This is the B Betty Dunn Nature Center. Since it's now open. Okay. That the new ADA compliant pathways in the However, the new center building will continue to be closed until March. All right. Well, so it's going to be really nice. So this is Cane Creek Falls again. It's just an upper view, I guess. Which would make sense. Yeah. Ooh, look at the rainbow. Look, there's a double rainbow. Oh my gosh. And then 
there's a closer up of this, of this falls, of the Cane Creek Falls. That's three rainbows today. Well, that parking lot is not where we parked our car. <laughs> so I have a feeling we're just gonna have to go back the way we came. I probably won't film too much going back because we're just going back the way we came. So if I see something really cool, I'll film it. Well, we get to go back up to the suspension bridge again. My gosh, you'd hate for this thing to break when you're on it. Ugh. There's definitely some ups. The stairs. So many stairs. <laughs> I feel like I've been on a stairmaster for an hour. <sighs> All right, so this, what we just did, if you go from the Fall Creek Falls to Kangford Creek Falls, um, I get it. I guess you could call it a loop. If you go the woodland side or the overlook side, you're kind of looping. But technically, it's like an out and back. So, you can see now we're at this sign here. And so normally, look at that turkey pin. Look at that turkey pin ridge trail. That's in, that's in the Smokies. How do we get to the Smokies? All right, this brought us out here. All right, back down the trail. All right, we are almost at our car. This is the lower loop trail. I think this trail is a 12 mile loop, recorded in the map, but we are actually just going to our car. So. We're not doing the lower loop trail. We are going this direction. You can see the cars already. I don't know what that other falls was oh, though. So fast. It wasn't that it wasn't that long of a trail. No, I don't know what that trail is. I don't, really, I don't know. No matter about. Oh, this oh, might be the bike trail. trail. Yeah, it's a bike trail. Oh yeah. Oh. Oh. What? Yeah, it was definitely not that long of a trail. Um probably the loop's about three miles. Um I think it just seemed a lot longer for us going because we just kept going off every little stop and like every little overlook, taking pictures, filming. I want to see what this sign said. Piney Falls Gorge. Well, no, that's a different direction though. Okay, we gotta go find out where Piney Falls Gorge is. Where is this gorge? All right, we made it to the Piney Falls Overlook. Well, yeah, the Piney Falls, so there's the Overlook is that direction. Suspension Bridge is this way. We're gonna go to the Suspension Bridge. And right off the trail, look, there's this sign, Overnight Trail. So I guess you can go that way to camp. That's pretty cool. Oh. What does this say? Caution. Do not go behind the fence. Wow. Die. <laughs> Just it looks so small in this thing. There's a cave down there. Here it is. Oh, I guess it doesn't really go over the falls. And there it is. And then there's suspension bridge. And then here's a rock outcropping, which takes you to look at that. I tell you, this is a pretty crowded area. There's people already like on the other side waiting. So I'm coming over here. Try to let you see. 
when I see and then that's what looks like over there there's people on the other side waving but we're not gonna go do any more hiking I think at this point it's getting kind of late so I'm gonna take a picture and then that's that so I assume that you keep going on a trail that way but it's kind of it's cold and we have like a two-hour drive a little two-hour drive back home it's already four o'clock at home so I think we're just gonna go go over to the overlook and then that's that there's info your pause your video And here's the other look. It's pretty. It's another big fall. We are back in our car. We are done with today's hike. This is pretty uh, awesome day. I like. I really enjoyed this that trail. I'm glad that we. I'm glad that I picked this hike to do today. <laughs> uh, what did you think about the? What did you think about Fall Creek Falls? I want to go back. Park. I yeah, that was pretty it. cool. I absolutely loved it. Um, so now I'm pretty hungry. So I think we're gonna go try to find something to eat. Hopefully, burger for us. <laughs> That's what I always want after a hike. I don't know why. Um, something unhealthy, like burger and fries. So I don't know what we're gonna find in this area here. I'm I would ask you all. 30. Oh, uh, straight. So yeah, straight. I have to tell Jane how to drive, as usual. Well, Jerry is determined for us to stop here. Yeah. It's yep. the Northgate Arcade Barbecue Restaurant. Let's see if it's any good. Mm -hmm. Hey, any place that has Euro Subs, burgers, fries, and barbecue? Mm -hmm. oh, here's what we got. I got my wish. Burger and fries. How's it taste? Alright guys, well, I'm fed and I'm tired. So, um... I think this is going to conclude this video. We are getting ready to head back on the road and head home. So until the next time, thank you so much for watching. If you did like this video, please be sure to hit the thumbs up button. And if you like this video and would like to see more of my videos, make sure that you are subscribed to my channel. And if you would like to get the notifications for when I post new videos, make sure you hit that bell. And until the next video, Happy hiking and happy trails. See you next time.